Hey guys, how's it going? Tom here, and I'm about to train hand grippers every day for the next 30 days. Hey guys, welcome to the video. Yes, you heard me right. I'm going to be using hand grippers every day for the next 30 days. It's a bit of a mental challenge, I know, but it's something I attempted probably coming on about 18 months ago, uh, just before we went down into lockdown, and it was, I was something I was really enjoying, actually. I did notice a lot of strength gains, surprisingly, but I also noticed a lot of pain in my hands and my wrist, which was ongoing for a few weeks after. I think I only made about 25 days into that one last time, but I've had a lot of comments on the blog um, that I posted with that, and I really want to have a go at finishing it this time. So... I'm gonna make sure we do it properly. I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna measure my forearms, my wrist, my current level of strength, and just see what kind of benefits you can get from training hand grippers every day. It's not something we usually advise. We usually say two to three times a week. Otherwise, you're just wearing out your joints and you're not gonna really get the kind of peaks you want with hand gripper training. Um, but I'm gonna give it a go. So first up, I'll measure my forearms we can have a look, see what kind of definition there is, if there's any at the moment, and then compare it after, obviously. Uh, so yeah, let's get into that. All right, guys, I've braved the t-shirt. It's absolutely freezing in here at the moment, so I'm gonna get these measurements done as quickly as I can. Uh, let's give it a go. So I'll start with the right wrist. Try and get it as tight as I can. Um, so that is seven and a half inches, my right wrist. And the same for my left wrist. Okay, let's go for the right forearm. That is 14 and a half inches. Uh, we'll try it flexed as well, see if that makes any difference. So that just takes up to 15. Let's go for the left. The left is 14 inches, and if we try and flex it a bit, not much difference, just over 14. Obviously, need to work on my left a bit. Uh, what we'll also do is just have a quick look, see if there's any real definition in the forearms, which doesn't look like there is really. Really, hopefully, we can get some development in the forearms um, with using the hand grippers every day. So next up, what I'll do is I will grab a few of the hand grippers, test out my max, see how many reps I can do, see what the toughest gripper is, and then we'll go from there. All right, now the fun begins. I can start testing out my max with the hand grippers. Um, I am planning to predominantly use the Elite Series and Godlike grippers during the 30 days, purely because I'm biased and I really like them. So I feel like I've got a really good balance there. Um, I can probably use the Godlike grippers when my hands are getting a bit sore because the knurling's not as sharp and then I'll definitely be using the Elite Series when it starts getting to higher level closes. Uh, you just get a lot more grip off the knurling on those and they feel better in my hands because of the handle size. It's just a comfort thing. So I'll just have a quick warm up now and then we'll get into the, the heavy stuff. <laughs> There we go, um, quick warm up there, just a few little stretches, resistance band, and a few squeeze on the gripper. Let's have a go. I think what I'll try and do is I'll work up to my heaviest gripper first and then work back down to complete max reps on probably the Elite 4 or 5. Okay. So, first up, let's have a go with the Elite 4. Just move this down a little. Okay, so the number four, nice and easy. <laughs> so the way I'll try and do it on my left hand, because it is a lot weaker than my right, it's hard. I've only got a very limited amount of left hand grippers. So the plan is to basically just try and keep us up as much as I can with the left hand. 
if that makes sense. Um, so I can still manage the four, which isn't too bad. So, number five. We'll definitely have to reorder the board so it's a lot easier. Um, but let's have a go at the number five here. So again, I'll just try no set first. Yeah, it's quite easy. Left hand. Ah, just about. That's not too bad. It's actually surprising that, to be honest. All right, I've got the number six here, if that's gonna focus, there we go. Um, I'll definitely have to give this a set. There's no way I can close it without. Okay, wow. Uh, it's the first time I've actually tried the six, I think, so really happy that I can close it. It's not very surprising because I haven't trained grippers in quite a while. I really don't think the left's going to be able to get this, but let's give it a go anyway. Ah, yeah, no chance. Uh, I think I will definitely not have a go at the seven because there's no chance, but I'll have a go on possibly Captains of Crush three. Three and a half, and also the Hades hand gripper. Okay, so I've got the Captains of Push three here. I'll just have a go on that. Hopefully, that'll focus. There we go. I think this rate's very similar to the number six, so should be able to get this uh, without too much trouble. Yeah, it's a piece of cake. Okay, let's try it on the left. <coughs> No chance. Left's absolutely dead already. Um, I think I'll have a go with Hades next. Just see if we can get a no set and close on it. Okay, that's not bad. Let's try the left. It's not too far off, but See, my left hand is way behind the right hand. Um, it's just the way it goes, unfortunately. Okay, so I've got the Captains of Crush 3.5 here. Let's have a go at this. Uh, again, I'll have to have a set on this. There's no chance I can do it without at the moment, anyway. <sighs> yeah, not up to that yet. Um, so at the moment, goal grippers are going to be the 3.5 and the Elite 7 for me. I'm not even going to attempt the 7 because it's just ridiculous. So what I will do now is I think I'll rep out with the 5 and the 4 on both hands. Um, yeah. All right, so I've got the Elite 5 here. Hopefully that's focused. Nice. Um, so I'll see how many reps I can get without setting. Hopefully more than two. It's just about seven there. Um, okay, let's try the left. didn't quite touch so two and maybe three we'll give it three um on the number five let's have a go with the number four next there it is come on no it's not focusing uh, number four anyway Okay, 
I think that's everything then. So what I'm going to do now is make a note of all the reps I've just done, which of the top grippers are closed, and work out a short training plan probably for the next seven days. Um, and then over the next 30 days, I'll be posting one video a day. I'll make sure to include the training routine so any of you that want to follow along, enjoy the pain with me, can. Hopefully, you know, I just really, really want to get started, see how good the results are without too much pain, hopefully. Um, I'll also make a note of some goals that I've got. Like, I know I really want to close the Captain's Crush 3.5, the Elite 7. That is my ultimate goal, really. Get the number 7, even with a 30 mil set, I'll be really happy with that. And if I can get 5 reps on Hades, I know that was something I used to be able to do, so hopefully I can get back to doing that. Um, yeah, so I will see you tomorrow for day one of using hand grippers every day for 30 days.